Hi everyone, Ginny Dodansky here. Hey, just a quick chat about a standardised way to use the beef and lamb sword stick for measuring pasture cover. First question to answer is which scale on the stick am I going to use? The easy way to address that is to think what season is the pasture that I'm looking at, what season did it grow in? It might not be the season that we're in now. Uh, here in the central North Island we've had a good three weeks or so of spring conditions now so I'm going to use the spring scale. Paddocks on sheep and beef farms are often quite patchy right, this paddock behind me has um, wintered cattle so it's got some very long fertility patches and then it's got areas that are almost bare. So where do you decide to put your sword stick down? Um, an easy way I was taught was to just let your eye cast out <clears throat> and to hit the longest uh, piece of grass you can see um, close to you and then look for the area where there's the shortest feed, um, which in some cases is bare, and then just choose an area uh, near there that's about middling between those two and put your sword stick down there. So for this little area here, we've got two long bits, We've got some really short stuff over here that's almost got nothing and then this stuff in the middle here um, is where I'm going to put my stick down. So measuring either the length of the average ryegrass leaf if you've got ryegrass or the tallest clover if you've got clover. So hopefully you can come to some sort of compromise there. Uh, for this area my tallest clover is about 3 centimetres. Um, so for spring feed that's just over 1300 kilos of dry matter. I'll repeat that measure in several parts of the paddock and then give myself an average as to what the cover is.